If you're looking to boost your Mutt team or make some money by selling coins, check out MobileMaddenCoins.com. Use code CLICKWID at checkout for a 10% discount. Hey, what is going on, guys? Clickwood here, back again with another Madden 16 Ultimate Team video. Guys, today we have what I believe is going to be the final golden ticket of the game in packs. We have strong safety version of Bo Jackson. Now, I think that's a little bit of a weird one. Uh, obviously, it's made by EA Sports themselves, or I guess I don't know if it was made by the, the Ultimate Team account, the Twitter account. I'm kind of confused at what was going on with this whole Bo Jackson thing, to be honest with you, because uh, I know one of the rules for making golden tickets was that the card had to already exist in the game. And yes, go while Bo Jackson does have a card in the game and he has even a previous golden ticket, he did not have a strong safety card in the game, which typically in the past has meant that you couldn't make him a strong safety. But obviously, it's EA, and they're making their own thing, and they're doing their own thing. So, you know, it is what it is as far as that goes. But this is a pretty cool card, guys. I'm excited for it. Let's see if we can pull it today. I'm not having great hopes, but you know what, man? If we can pull something good, that would be fun. Uh, there's also still the boss legends in the game today as well. Ray Lewis, Tony Gonzalez still in packs. There's a whole bunch of really good stuff we could potentially pull today. So what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to show you real quickly what we're going to pull. Uh, by the way, we are going to pull five of these Memorial Day packs as well because that's the max that we can pull. Um, I know that they don't give us great chances to pull stuff, but, you know, it's it's fun to pull them and, you know, why the hell not? So we'll do that. But we've also got a whole bunch of other stuff to pull today. Uh, we've got uh, two Game Changer packs, two Veteran packs, two All Madden packs two pro packs, and then we've still also got this ultimate pack. So we're going to save the ultimate pack for the final one because I know that's probably, well, it's, maybe it's not the best pack in the game. It's definitely one of the best packs in the game. So uh, we will save that for the last and final thing. Hopefully we can pull something amazing out of that. But why don't we start off here with the pro packs. And also, guys, why the hell not? We're also going to open up this Campus Hero Elite pack. I know that we can't pull the golden ticket out of that. But, you know, why the hell not? We'll pull that as well. So, all right, two pro packs. We'll start it off with the with the junk. Uh, probably not going to be anything out of these like there usually isn't. And, yeah, it's really not much. If that was like a golden ticket Levine Toy Lolo, that would be cool. But probably not going to happen. So, all right, let's continue on here. Hopefully we can get something out of one of these packs, though. And we get a base elite Gerald McCoy. Not worth a whole lot, but, hey, why, why the hell not? Let's continue to rip open these packs here. Veteran pack. These things, what, do they get, contain two gold or better players or something like that? These things are kind of junk, too, to be honest. Um, and we get a TJ Clemmings out of it, an all-rookie TJ Clemmings. So that's actually not too bad. I mean, honestly, that's really not that bad of a pull out of the veteran pack. I will definitely take that. We've still got one more of those. So we will rip that one here. And William Goldston. Probably not going to be anything great out of this. Jameis Winston. All right. So... We still got a lot of really good packs here, man. Um, it, these are the ones that I think are going to be the best. So let's actually go back and open up our Memorial Day packs because, like I said, we're going to do five of those. Or actually, first, let's do the Campus Hero Elite pack. Maybe we can get something good out of this. I have no idea what the value of any of these cards are. Dwayne Brown, I'm assuming he's probably one of the worst ones you can pull. It's a left tackle, and it's Madden. So offensive linemen are typically not worth a damn thing, but hey. Still an elite, a guaranteed elite out of the pack, so that's not too bad. That's that's something that we got out of the uh, the journey solos, the journey five solos. So, um, all right, let's go back here. Let's open up the Memorial Day packs because, like I said, we can open up five of these. This will give us actually a decent opportunity to get potentially one of the boss cards or the golden ticket or something like that. Get the Memorial Day badge right out of the way to start it off. Um, I think there's two of those in each pack, is what it said. So we'll see if there's anything else good out of this. Doesn't look like it. I Now, I don't really remember what you can get with the Memorial Day badges. Um, it looks like you can only put them in the bigger than football set. So why the, why the hell not? Let's do that. We'll just put all of them into the bigger than football set. I have no idea how many of those you need. Um, so if if we can get something with it, then you guys will see that. If not, you know, we'll just uh, we'll hold on to that and, then, and do it another time. But... Um, so if you guys didn't see, by the way, these do contain four gold or better players, which is why I'm opening them up because um, the pro packs typically only contain one. So the value, although it's not really there, you can you can still pull stuff out of it. And, and um, there are a lot of people who say you just have a better chance of pulling great stuff out of the, the better packs. So uh, and by the way, Kevin Dodd. Like, you couldn't find him a better picture than this EA. <laughs> like, Jesus, the dude looks like he's going to pass out. Come on. Let's continue on here. We'll throw again these Memorial Day badges into the set real quickly. 
So really not a whole lot out of these packs to start it off, unfortunately. But again, we're saving the best stuff for last. I, I really haven't gotten any great pulls lately, man. Like, it's been so long. It would be so great to just get one really good pull. Come on. All right, we still got three more of these, though. These things are not too expensive. 50,000 coins actually isn't that bad. And we get the two Memorial Day badges back to back. Come on. Give me something a little bit better than that, please. Hook me up, EA, one time. Come on. Juice my packs for once, damn it. <laughs> Nothing out of this one either. All right, so we still got two more of them, and then we'll go on to the All Maddens, uh, the Game Changers. These, I mean, that's really where it's going to be, I think. Oh, not a pro pack. We need to do the, uh, the Memorial Day pack. Uh, and by the way, guys, if you didn't see... Head on over to Samuel Brown RBT's channel because we are going to be doing like a 400 and something thousand coin giveaway uh, because we messed up on our, uh, oh, and we get a Lawrence Timmons, okay. It was base elite. I saw a third elite. I thought it was going to be something nice, but um, yeah, so we messed up on our large quick sell war because we're actually on opposite consoles and we didn't really realize it until the end. So uh, yeah, so basically what we did then was that we ended up giving away all of the coins that we uh, would have otherwise given away. So or otherwise would have given to one another. So if you guys want to head over to his channel, he has a video up. Uh, you can see the rules on how to do that over on his channel. Again, Samuel Brown RBT. If you type that into the YouTube search bar, you will find it. Otherwise, uh, if you go back to one of my previous Previous videos you'll find a link to it in that so let's see here memorial day badges junk 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 dunk all right so the nice thing is is that there's a lot of golds in these packs so at least you know again i always say this at least we're getting closer to the large quick cells and the quick cells i think are at this point the most fun thing in the game because like i never pull anything out of regular packs so you know it is what it is all right we're done with the Memorial Day packs, didn't pull anything out of those, but we've still got about five more really, really nice packs to pull here. So we're getting down here, but I mean, definitely got good stuff still. Um, I'm going to try and find somebody to do, to do the Super Bowl Legend Topper with me, and hopefully we can do like some sort of a, a giveaway or like a, a challenge or something like that with that. Um, same thing with the Campus Legend pack, the Throwback pack, the Flashback pack. Uh, and then, of course, we're going to continue to try and do some more large quick sell wars for you guys here on the channel. For now, though, we've got all Mad Packs, Game Changer Packs, and the Ultimate Pack still in this video. So, here we go, guys. All Madden Pack number one. These things are pretty beastly. We can get good stuff out of these. There's a lot of golds, a lot of gold or better pulls. But it doesn't look like anything really great out of it. So, we get a Football Outsiders Theo Riddick. I mean, meh. Not really anything good there. What do these even freaking contain? I don't even remember, but I know that they have a lot. I think it can guarantee it's one of like the promo, gold or better promo players, which are almost always a football outsider's junk card. And nothing, nothing, nothing. Yeah, there it is. Team of the Week, Brian Hoyer. Like, yeah, those all Madden packs. I mean, they're, they're good because they've got some golds and stuff, but like... The value just isn't really there. They're a little bit better than the than the Memorial Day packs, basically. That's about it. So, all right. We've still got the Game Changers and the Ultimate Pack. So, come on, Ray Lewis. Be inside of your own damn pack, please. Come on. One time. Let's go. Come on. Case Keenum. There's a lot of golds in these. This is, I mean, we've got a lot of chances here. Gazer Charitalis. Roberto Garza. Colin Kaepernick. Michael Crabtree. A gold badge. Come on, dude. Reggie Nelson. Logan Ryan. Dude, just garbage. Garbage, garbage, garbage out of this pack. Absolute trash. Probably the best thing was the gold badge. Like, ugh. Come on, man. Help me one time, EA. Please give me something good. Second game changer pack. Ray Lewis on the cover. Is he going to be inside of his own damn pack or not? Probably not. Let's be completely honest here. Aaron Williams, nothing, dude. Just like trash, trash on trash, a draft badge. We'll throw that in. We've got one more card in this pack. Just garbage in all of these. Two game changer packs, all garbage. Not a single elite pull even. Not even a base elite pull. Uh, if you believe in the boot on being accounts, on accounts, man, this is definitely the boot. I got a freaking lead boot on my account. This is disgusting. Just absolutely jack shit out of every pack. All right. So we do get a gold draft player pack because we just finished that NFL draft uh, set. So we'll throw that in here. And we get a Corey Coleman. I don't think that's worth much. But, 
hey, I actually heard Corey, Corey Coleman is actually pretty talented, so I'm so excited to see what he does in the NFL this year. All right, guys, final pack of the pack opening video. We've got an ultimate pack here. Now, these things, if I remember correctly, go for like 200,000 coins when they're in the game. You guys tell me. Will this thing have 200,000 coins of value in it? <laughs> I don't even think we have 100,000 coins in total value of all the stuff that I've opened up today. And, uh, yeah, we opened up, what, two Game Changer packs, which by themselves would have been, I don't know, 200, 300,000 coins. Uh, I forget how much the Game Changers go for. I want to say I want to say it's 100,000, but I'm, I don't really remember. Either way, Ultimate Packs, like 200K or 150K or something like that for these. So these things are, like, the best packs in the game. Please, a golden ticket, a boss legend, just one freaking time, EA. Please, come on. Let's do this. One time. Help me one time. Let's go. William Jackson. Okay. And we get a Jamie Collins. At least it's an elite. I know it's a base elite, but at this point, I have to, like, be happy about that. Jared Allen. Paris Harrison. Come on. Oh, my gosh, dude. Look at all this trash. Look at all this trash. We get a Thomas Davis, a second base elite. Just no value out of these whatsoever. Holy crap, man. Oh, my gosh. We get another base elite, 85 overall, Fletcher Cox. These are like the worst elites that you can pull. Come on, man. And that's going to do it. Holy crap. These are some awful packs, dude. I hope you guys had better luck pulling your journey packs than I did because... I don't think I got a single thing worth more than, like, 10K in any of my journey packs that I opened. Like, that is insane. Now, granted, I've still got all these. I've still got the Super Bowl Legend Topper. Now, all of these will be over 10K at least, um, the, th the three of these. And then I've got the Campus Legend Pack that I decided to do because I'm insane, apparently. Um, but And because I want to pull a freaking Reggie Bush. Like, I really want to pull a Reggie Bush, but... Um, you know, man, I, I feel like I, I kind of got the shaft on the on the um, uh, journey packs. So I don't know. Like I said, guys, I hope you had better luck than I did. If you enjoyed this video, though, please do me a favor and click the like button. Sorry we couldn't get anything great pulled today. But again, uh, we'll be back with doing more packs here over the next couple of weeks. Um, I know it sounds like golden tickets are out of packs now or uh, going forward. But, you know, there's still going to be ultimate boss legends and things like that and other great stuff that will be in packs. So we're going to continue to open up packs until the end of this game I hope uh, unless it really really tones down as far as uh, stuff that you can get out of packs and then I might just spend them and do crazy stuff like more throwback packs and flashback packs and fun stuff like that so uh, again guys hope you enjoyed it if you did do me a favor click the like button subscribe to the channel if you're new and I will talk to you guys again soon